Hey guys and girls, welcome back to another beautiful video on Spiffle Channel, Spiffle Day. We're gonna keep working on this texture, fixing all these textures and stuff. Uh, that's where we're loading that. I wanna go in and check enemy bullet. Alright, that's the one I wanna check. I wanna go in and, and just load this in here first, I guess. We'll call it round bullet. Um, bullet. Circular. Uh, circular. That's number zero, one, two, three. That's number three. Bullet circular. Red. All right. And let's load that. Textures, guns. Uh, let's just call it red bullet round or the other way around round bullet red like that round bullet red round whoops round bullet red so here I'm just showing exactly how we're gonna add something to it that's good now we added something to it okay good that's our enum right there. Textures, number of textures, in the textures. Fine. So we in it initialize all the bullet textures and we can load them just properly, just the way they're supposed to be loaded. Like this, depending on the type. This, let's say this type. Uh, and we have some error checks, which is really important. So let's say that bullet is good. Now, player, as we create a kind of a bullet. Uh, get take damage update leveling up this test change accessories is there any problems right here right current weapon uh, where's bullet right here bullet laser um, let's see current weapon bullet laser so that's zero what we do need, we do need an enum for a player as well, called weapons. We do need that. Uh, enum. Sorry about that. Weapons. Laser. Uh, normal. Zero. Missile light. Missile heavy so these are the these are the different types of weapons we have as a player and then laser normal uh, player laser normal let's just go down see what what else the problem is it's fine I think there's something wrong in here as well we got to fix all of this because now we changed the whole bullet thing Close the player constructor, go down to, I think I might be take damage, no, update, get damage, okay, so player laser normal, player missile light, light, missile heavy, so depending on those, we have different effects, that's good, so get damage is fine. Let's go down here. So let's say current weapon, player laser normal. Then we'll say we'll actually send in bullet laser red. I think I'll call it laser red because that's the actual bullet. So I'll call it laser red. As we do this, we will change our bullet now if we have the main gun level one bullet laser red and then bullet laser red here as well um, bullet laser red bullet laser red still laser because that's all the three now we have player missile light you see what I'm doing I'm just changing everything and then we'll just say 
missile light. Le left, right? Yeah, left. That's the bullet. Bullet, missile, light, right. Let's copy this. This is for the dual. Dual missiles. Wait, so it's. Uh, wait, what? Oh, okay, so I add one extra if. Okay, that's cool. Um, player missile heavy. You see how much easier this is now? And then I'll do something here. Now I don't have that yet, so so that's okay. Uh, I need to actually open that up because I don't know why I did that. So there we go. That's fine. Uh, we have some more issues down here. And I think it's draw right now. Update, I think. No, reset. I think might be reset. Here we go. Laser normal. Let's see, did I use that function? Upgrades uh, acquired clear. Set gun level. Yeah, set gun level zero. So what if I go into uh, set gun level in player? Just let me just check that. Set gun level. Get 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 position. Okay, set gun. What? Are you serious? Set. Why isn't this working, dude? What the hell? Okay. Um. Set gun level right here. So it's a okay. It's a regular function. Set point, set gun level, set gun level. It's probably up here. Yeah, here we go. So main gun level is less than main gun textures that size. Set texture, main gun level. This main gun level. Okay, so this is set gun level is zero. Okay, so I just set it to zero. But then I could do this instead, reset. Instead of zero, I could say player laser normal. Just do that, and that'll be zero. That's good. Perfect. Perfect. Uh, perfect, perfect, perfect. So player is good, bullet's good. I think I fixed all the problems here. Now I just need to load all the, I just need to call that in game, right? And it textures. Oh no. Good lord hammers. Oh no. Oh no. Where did I screw that up? Ah oh, shit. Oh god. Oh no, it's right here. Woof. I was like, what the hell? Okay, so we'll just remove that now because that's done. Please work. Please, 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 please. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, so uh, let's just bullet init textures. Good. And then we'll keep working. This is gonna be easy now. It's not too big of a deal. Pick up. Uh, I did pick up already. Now upgrade. Perfect. Let's close bullet. Bullet. Player. Player. I think enemy is gonna be a big problem. Let me just open enemy quickly. Enemy.cpp because where I create the bullets there's gonna be problem update and then shoot here we go bullet so it's it's doing this I'll say bullet bullet uh, red laser red bullet circular red uh, circular red Why is that a problem? I mean, I'm not. Oh wait, that's why. 
There we go. So that alleviated the problem right there. It will create one of those. No big deal. I think that's all we had to do with enemy. Except also take these down. And then... Oh, wait. What is this? This is CPP, right? Let me take this away. And take that enemy bullets thing away. Because that's dumb. No, that's not dumb. That's really smart. Because we need that. Enemy... Going to static here. Let me just copy that. Take these functions and put them above because I want everything to look good. These are just regular functions. Uh, just like this. Regular functions. Static. Okay, so these are all the enemy bullets weapons uh, regular and then missile that's fine types are good that's fine follow move fast follow left follow shoot just like this and we can close these as well that's the good thing so weapons enemies all right so statics dra textures Textures, just like that. Texture, textures. Static int uh, number of textures. And then, a function void static void init textures. Boom. Copy all of these, go up into CPP file our beautiful CPP file and just in it here static define any bullets any textures uh, and more textures and then boom Static. There we go. All right, so we're good. Now we we did this. Let's say enemy number of textures equals enemy textures dot size. Easy, and then we'll just init initialize everything. So let's go to init enemy textures. Remove that enemies right here. Remove this enemy bullet textures don't need those see how this is much cleaner uh, do that just say enemies uh, enemy in it textures BAM easy as that and in here we'll copy paste this make a texture temp to this enemy Textures add. So just go ahead and do this for everything. You can skip the next video if you want, I guess, because I'm just going to be doing this. But go ahead and go skip through that if you need. Otherwise, just update your code from GitHub because this is all I'm going to be doing just now, uh, fixing all of these issues here to make it more clean. Is all I need. I can remove this now as, as well. So it's a cleaner, better way of handling everything. And there's going to be some problems. So if this type is greater than enemy number of textures, because we're going to have number of textures, yes, and then enemy textures. Or this type is less than zero. We're going to say error no type constructor enemy. Boom. So that's good. Now, when we set the texture for the enemy, okay, that, that won't matter. So that's good. Enemy is fine. Let's go into game again. Uh, particles. What is the problem? Enemy bullet update. 
I bet there's a problem in here. I bet there's a problem in here somewhere. That wasn't it. Enemy update. Here we go. That was a problem. <laughs> 